Neil Dariush experienced heartbreak at the hands of Charles Oliveira in Saturday's UFC 289 main event. His eight-fight winning streak comes to an abrupt end courtesy of a first-round TKO by the former UFC lightweight champion Oliveira. Dariush could not really get going too much in this fight. He ate a head kick in the opening seconds of this matchup. He tried to get a little offense in, had some top position on the ground and things like that, but just in terms of any damage or anything overly effective, he wasn't able to do a whole lot to Oliveira in there, and I think that's a sign of Oliveira's greatness and not necessarily an indictment on Darius. Seen some people saying that Everyone, including myself, who said he should have been given a lightweight title shot by this point with his winning streak was unjust or something in that vein. I think he definitely could have been given a title shot somewhere along the way here, but this is the way it goes sometimes. He saw the end of the road in this winning streak here, and this is going to be a tough hurdle for him to overcome. I think he is still obviously one of the very best lightweights in the world and has a lot to offer in this division and a lot of compelling matchups ahead, but this one definitely did feel like a significant blow to his aspirations to get to the very top of this weight class. Perhaps he can work himself back up, but there's going to be no easy fights ahead for him, and he's likely going to have to fight downward in the rankings next. You look at kind of the lay of the land at 155 pounds, the person who is closest ranked to him that makes the most sense, also coming off a loss would be Rafael Faziv. That would be an extremely exciting fight between those two. Of course, Darius, you would think, would have a fairly sizable advantage on the ground if it did go there. The striking would be an interesting matchup as well. So both these guys coming off losses. Of course, Faziv just was defeated in his most recent bout by Justin Gaethje back in March. And if you could put these two together, it would be a big-time fight for the UFC, an easy fight night main event or pay-per-view main card fight however you want to run it but i love the idea of Darius versus faziv coming off ufc 289 and seeing which guy would suffer two straight losses and seeing which one would get back on track